It was winter, and the festival of the dedication of the temple was being celebrated in Jerusalem. Jesus was walking in Solomon's porch in the temple when the people gathered round him. How long are you going to keep us in suspense? Tell us the plain truth. Are you the Messiah? I have already told you, but you would not believe me. The deeds I do by my father's authority speak on my behalf. But you will not believe, for you are not my sheep. My sheep listen to my voice. I know them and they follow me. I give them eternal life and they shall never die. No one can snatch them away from me. What my Father has given me is greater than everything. And no one can snatch them away from the Father's care. The Father and I are one. And the people again picked up stones to throw at him. I have done many good deeds in your presence, which the Father gave me to do. For which one of these do you want to stone me? We do not want to stone you because of any good deeds, but because of your blasphemy. You're only a man, but you're trying to make yourself God. It is written in your own law that God said you are gods. We know that what the scripture says is true forever. And God called those people gods, the people to whom his message was given. As for me, the Father chose me and sent me into the world. How then can you say that I blaspheme because I said that I am the Son of God? Do not believe me then if I am not doing the things my Father wants me to do, but if I do them, even though you do not believe me, you should at least believe my deeds in order that you may know once and for all that the Father is in me and that I am in the Father. Blasphemy! Once more they tried to seize Jesus, but he slipped out of their hands. Jesus then went back again across the Jordan River to the place where John had been baptizing, and he stayed there. Many people came to him. John performed no miracles, they said, but everything he said about this man was true and many people there believed in him. <laughs>